you spoke about coming here to Ghana. Obviously, you were, oil and gas was on the forefront of your mind. Are there other countries? No, it wasn't. I didn't even know about oil and oh, gas. Before you came. Oh, okay. You're still doing telecom. That became the business. Are there other countries on the continent, there's 54, that people should be looking at, that there's opportunities inside of them as well, right? Because we know Ghana, and for America, it feels like this is the first place we got to come. Talk about some of, some of the pros and cons of, of some of the countries, and, and where are those countries uh, on the continent? It's a great I question. Mean, Nigeria is the biggest you know, um, country in, uh, in this region. I mean, I think it's the big, biggest economy in Africa right now. Um, definitely, um, West, in terms of West Africa, uh, Nigeria is, 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 is a big dog. Um, it has a lot of opportunity. It has some cons, um, which I think uh, they are working on, some security issues. But um, Nigeria, Nigeria, Nigeria has, has, has opportunities. Um, a lot of African countries have opportunities. I think we need to stop watching Discovery Channel so much with kids with Koshoko and you know, flies and stuff. There are real opportunities in Africa. Look, GE is here, Microsoft, they are all on the continent. All these blue chip companies are on the continent. So I don't want to limit any country. I mean, we have operations in other African countries as well. Some in the um, uh, French speaking countries, Burkina, Mali, all over. So, you know, you just have to figure out what it is um, that works for you. If it doesn't work for you in Ghana, it doesn't mean it will not work for you in, um, in Nigeria. It will not work for you in Congo, you know, Angola, Rwanda, Kenya. I mean, it's, 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 it's huge. It's massive. So you have to figure out your niche and what works. I just believe Ghana is the gateway to Africa. And then up through the gateway, you can go. Clap it up to, for that. Well, yeah, yeah. Well, you can go wherever else you want to go. So that's, that's my opinion. Africa is open. I mean, Ghana is open for business, but Africa is also open for business. So we want to thank you. Be generous with your time. My last question is, um, in 10 years, what's, what's your plan? How do you, where do you see yourself you know, in 10 years from now? This, this hits a bit hard because, like I just said, you know, I, 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 I lost... Um, Send condolences to yeah, 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 it's fine. Now, I've lost two close people to me within the last five, six weeks. Um, and what I've learned from this is that a lot of times we focus so much on the past and the future and we don't enjoy you know the, the, the moment that we are in i think we need to start enjoying the moment that we are in we need to start and what do i mean by that if there's something that i can do today i'm going to get it done today i love that if there's someone that i can help today i'm going to help you today i am not going to wait next week because you know what this moment is guaranteed two hours from now is not guaranteed so 10, hour, 10, 10 years from now is the guarantee. So I think uh, my perspective has kind of changed a little bit from losing friends who were close to me, who I was with a few hours before they passed. And what I'm saying to myself is, I'm gonna make the best out of my life on the daily business. Every minute that I'm blessed with, I'm gonna make the best out of it. I'm gonna work as hard as I can. I'm gonna do as much as I can. And I'll try and enjoy life as much as I can because all the plans that we make are not guaranteed. When we leave here, Nothing is guaranteed. So my, my, my kind of new um, approach is yes, I have plans, you know, we have, we, we want to take over Africa. We, we want to be able to touch so much lives. You know, we support um, about 10,000 underprivileged children. We want to move it to about a million, you know, underprivileged children. We want to make sure that we are, we, are, we, are, we, are the, we are the go to company in Africa. All those things, yes, they're all well and good. But I want to enjoy the moments. I want to enjoy it now. I want to enjoy it. all the people that are here um, yes. in Ghana, you know, and wish everyone the best of luck or whatever it is they are doing now. I'm not going to wait and wish the best of luck whatever they're doing in the next five years. So that's how I see life right now. Make some noise, ladies and gentlemen. Make some noise, brother. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, bro. Thank you.